Welcome to the presentation of our work, Lotus Locality Optimizing Triangle Counting. Our group in Queen's University Belfast consists of Professor Hans van Dierendonk, Professor Peter Kilpatrick, and me, Mohsen Kui. In triangle counting problem, we enumerate and count uh, triangles in, in an uh, undirected graph. Triangle counting has applications in different fields of science, industry, and humanities. However, efficient triangle counting is still a challenge for fast-growing real-world graphs with uh, a good degree distribution. Forward algorithm is the state-of-the-art uh, triangle counting and starts by reordering the graph. The reordering assigns uh, the lower IDs to vertices with higher degree and edges are assigned to their endpoint with higher ID. Then for each vertex such as V and uh, its neighbor U, the intersection of neighbors identifies the triangles formed by U and V. As an example, um, Vertex 3 has three neighbors, 0, 1, 2, and the uh, triangles of vertex 3 are uh, common neighbors of 3 and uh, each of these three neighbors. Now we present an analysis of forward algorithm for real world graphs with a good degree distribution. We divide vertices to a hop and non hop vertices and we select 1% of vertices with maximum degrees as hops. Edges with uh, at least one hop endpoint uh, are called uh, hop edges and uh, also we call a triangle as a hop triangle if uh, at least one of its vertices is a hop vertex. Statistically, uh, more than 70% of uh, edges are hop edges and uh, more than 90% of triangles are hop triangles. Since hops have several edges to different vertices, neighbor lists of hops are frequently accessed uh, during triangle counting in forward algorithm. For example, in this graph, neighbor lists of vertices 0 and 1 are accessed in processing vertices 2, 3, 4, and 5. In this way, cache is persistently dedicated to neighbor list of hops and access to neighbor list of uh, non-hop vertices that contain 80% of edges suffer from poor locality. Random memory access in triangle counting are performed to topology data which is uh, proportional to number of edges. Since the number of hops are very small, but uh, they form more than 70% of edges, it's uh, wasteful to use uh, the same bit width for IDs uh, of all vertices. And uh, a compact representation of hops can significantly improve memory locality. Then another problem uh, in a forward algorithm is accessing the hop edges even when the vertex uh, doesn't have any edges to hops. For example, in this graph in processing vertex 6, neighbor lists of uh, vertices 5 and 4 that uh, contain hop edges are accessed, but uh, 6 uh, doesn't have uh, any edges to hops and uh, cannot form uh, any triangle with hops. Our evaluation shows that uh, more than 50% of accesses to hop edges can be avoided uh, by avoiding fruitless searches. We explained uh, three inefficiencies in the forward algorithm for processing power law graphs. Uh, low locality for processing uh, non-hop vertices, lack of compactness and inefficient usage of cache capacity, and fruitless searches. The main cause of uh, these inefficiencies is uh, mixing uh, hop and non-hop edges in the same graph. 
we introduce the Lutes algorithm that uh, divides the graph into three subgraphs. Hop to hop edges that contain edges uh, that contains edges between uh, hop vertices. Hop edges subgraph that contains uh, edges with at least one hop endpoint and the non-hop edges uh, subgraph that contains edges uh, between non-hop vertices. Lotus uh, selects uh, 2 to power 16 or 16, 64 kilo, kilo vertices uh, with uh, maximum degrees as hops and uh, it uses uh, 16 bits IDs uh, to represent hops. Since hops uh, and non-hops subgraphs uh, are separated in Lutes, uh, we can use uh, different bit width uh, for their IDs. Based on the Lutes uh, graph structure, four types of uh, triangles can be defined. Triple edge triangles that uh, are formed by three hop vertices HHN triangles that are formed by two hop and one non hop vertices, HNN triangles that are formed by one hop and uh, two non hop vertices, and triple N triangles that are formed by three non hop vertices. We divide the uh, triangle counting into three steps counting triple H and uh, HHN triangles. Counting uh, HNN triangles and counting triple N triangles. In counting triple H and HHN triangles, the main question is if two hops are connected. Lotus uh, iterate, iterates over all distinct pairs of hop neighbors of each vertex and uses the H to H bit array to check if two hops are connected. H2H has a size of uh, 256 megabytes and 90% of memory accesses are concentrated to 25% of uh, H2H that can be easily maintained by the cache. In counting HNN triangles, we have to identify the common hop neighbors of a non-hop vertex and uh, its non-hop neighbors. Target of random memory accesses uh, is uh, hop neighbor lists uh, in uh, hop edges uh, subgraph. Lotus uses uh, six, uh, 16 bits uh, IDs for hops uh, in uh, HE subgraph and uh, provides effi efficient usage of cache capacity. In counting triple N triangles, Lotus applies the forward algorithm on the uh, non-hop edges subgraph. Lotus doesn't access uh, hop neighbors uh, in counting triple, triple N, N triangles and uh, prevents uh, fruitless searches. We evaluate Lotus uh, for graphs up to 162 billion edges and on three machines uh, with different uh, architectures and uh, up to 128 cores. The evaluation shows that Lotus uh, provides 2.2 uh, up to 5.5 times speed up into in comparison to previous works. Conclusion we explain three problems uh, in forward algorithm in processing power low graphs. Low locality in processing non-hop vertices, lack of compactness and fruitless searches. We introduce the Lotus uh, triangle counting algorithm that uh, separates uh, processing of hop edges from non-hop edges and uh, organizes uh, triangle counting into three steps. In each step, Lotus concentrates the random memory accesses to a, a smaller special data structure that is most frequently accessed and uh, is retained in the cache. Thank you and uh, further discussions are available on 
our website plugs.qb.ac.uk slash graph processing thank you